Statistics in Trinidad and Tobago report that there are over 200 cases of cervical cancer being diagnosed yearly. And according to OBGYN specialist and director of the Venus Clinic, Dr. Earl Braffitt, the prevalence is growing. Looking back at the incidence of it in Trinidad, we have been documenting over about 190 to 200 cases per year, um, which on record is leading in the Caribbean. Now, we know that this, these figures may actually be underestimated, so we might actually be much more in terms of the number of cases of cervical cancer. Cervical cancer affects the cervix of the female reproductive organ and is preventable. But the mouth of the womb, that's what is in close proximity to the vagina, that is what we call the cervix, okay? So cancer basically is an abnormal growth of cells in this location that can actually spread beyond this location and infiltrate wider tissues and spread to other organs, okay? So the cancer of the cervix is actually one of the few cancers that is actually, for lack of a better word, is actually a sexually transmitted condition. He says the human papillomavirus is the leading cause of cervical cancer. While vaccines can protect against 70 to 80 percent of cervical cancers, people may still be at risk of getting other types of HPV. Experts say cervical cancer does not have obvious symptoms and screening is a must. Well, we try to um, check or what we call screen for this type of condition via um, using the pap smears or what we call HPV testing. Now, we want to prevent the cancer from happening because once the cancer is formed, the treatment tends to be very invasive and sometimes ineffective, okay? So we're talking about either chemotherapy, radiation, or even very um, detailed type of surgery, okay? And if it reaches beyond the pelvic area, then we're talking just about palliation. In commemoration of Cervical Cancer Month, several organizations will be aiming to raise awareness of cervical cancer, like My Sister's Keeper and the Venus Clinic, who will be hosting the PAP Party in celebration of women's health at the Nelson Mandela Park on Saturday. They will be offering free cervical screening tests, HPV vaccinations, and cervical cancer education. Marie Hall, Seniors.